They have gotten so much money already, they hope to get a lot more and they hope to get more power by doing so. member of the opposition and you've said recently on several occasions that all the government party is concerned with is handing this country over to Guatemala now why do you say that because I was a member of the People's United Party that's the government that's the government now in yes. British Honduras yes and I was sent to Guatemala the first time in October 1961 to meet the president of Guatemala I was sent from the PUP government When I met the Digoras, we spoke about self-government and independence for British Honduras. Well, I told him that um, Mr. Price said... He's the he was, first minister. Mr. Price, yes. the first minister of British Honduras, said he was fighting to help us get independence, which was something good and all the people wanted it. Well, the Digoras Fuentes, who is the president of Guatemala, just laughed at me. He said I was a fool to believe something like that. That Guatemala wouldn't fight for British Honduras if they had nothing to gain. But they hope to get this place, British Honduras, and make it his 23rd department. So you think that the government here is in uh, league with, uh, with the Digoras to help him in his aims, or do you think they're in league with him merely as a political maneuver to get independence for British Honduras? Well, I am sure that they are fighting side by side with the president of Guatemala to make this place a part of Guatemalan territory. But why do you think they want to do that? They have gotten so much money already, they hope to get a lot more and they hope to get more power by doing so. They have gotten so much money already, they hope to get a lot more and they hope to get more power by doing so. They have gotten so much money already, they hope to get a lot more and they hope to get more power by doing so. Thank you.